Hello everyone, welcome to Excellence Language Learning Hub. I'm Tadriana, your instructor as of today. And today we will be learning about wrongly pronounced words that we say on a daily basis. Or some of them we do not use on a daily basis but we do use as formal, uh, formally or in a business or at school or any type of interview. So before we get started, do not forget to like, subscribe, share and also do not forget to click on the notification bell that's there and do watch the previous videos if you uh, have problems with alphabetical pronunciation do check that out and if you think you are very highly professional with english do check the grammars that are already posted and if you'd like to know about bangla to english or just english there are two instructors other than me who teach both of them so let's get started okay uh, already i wrote this wrongly pronounced these uh, under this i'm gonna write some words that we pronounce wrong on a daily basis so i'll write them down and you have to repeat after me that way you'll know how to pronounce them correctly and it will help you very much mischievous um, as we can see, I wrote mischievous on the board. Common mistake that we make is mischievous. Mischievous. Uh, the way it's pronounced, obviously I'm going to write it down next to this so that you know what I wrote and you could say it after me. Mischievous. Mischievous. Uh, so do not forget to um, fix it and do not say mischievous. Mischievous uh, is no meaning. It has no meaning to it and that's not how you pronounce it. Mischievous is how you uh, usually pronounce and how we uh, in American accent we use say it like that. But it, when it comes to British accent it's definitely different. So let's move on to Number two. Mauve. Mauve. Okay, uh, here's a joke because I did not say it or pronounce this correctly. Mauve, it's mauve. It's mauve. I'll write the pronunciation down. This is not the correct spelling which I wrote for mischievous. It's just how you pronounce it. Uh, it's the pronunciation spelling. So um, I will write for mob. So repeat after me. If you think you need to take notes, write it down in a pen and paper. I will wait or pause the video. Go get it and we can do it together. Move. M O A V E. This is how you pronounce it. Move. M O A V E. Move. all drink coffee in the morning or at evening and whatnot uh, but here's a silly mistake that we make when we order coffee for example um, a few weeks ago i went to a coffee restaurant and i heard someone say hey can i have a cup of espresso please and that's when i realized hey, i should be teaching you guys about this so espresso uh, there's no x in the espresso so please do not add the x the x is silent in espresso the x is always silent do not say it when you pronounce espresso um, so if you think this has helped you please do not do not forget to let me know uh, because I'm just trying to help everyone who's out there and having problems with how to pronounce a uh, few words and you know alphabets and whatnot in the conversation so please let me know if i'm helpful to you it will be very nice for me to know that i am actually doing something right 
So let's move on to four number. Kilometer. Uh, when I say kilometer, um, a lot of people pronounce as kilometer, kilometer, or kilometer, it's something like that. So when I say kilometer, there's an accent, also a proper pronunciation. Uh, like always, I will write the pronunciation spelling right here, so you can just write it down or pronounce it with me. It's kil o It's kill o meter. That's the proper pronunciation. Kill o meter. Kill o meter. Okay. Um, let's move on to five. Prerogative. Um, so we all know Britney Spears, the singer. So this in this one video, she pronounced it as prerogative. Prerogative. So prerogative is not the correct one. Prerogative is the correct one because um, it has a different uh, pronunciation and accent. Uh, like I told you before, I'm not teaching a British accent. I'm teaching an American. So if you would like to know about British accent, I will be posting a video in the future about how to pronounce few things in British accent. So in that way, you will know both the pronunciation and you can actually inherit both of the accents. So let me write down the proper pronunciation spelling. Prerogative, 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 not prerogative. It does not have a meaning. Okay. Uh, if you think you have to write this down or you haven't written down already, please pause the video because I will be erasing the board and start from six to ten again. Okay. And supposedly these are two different words and they have different meaning obviously these are not wrongly pronounced sometimes they are supposedly or supposedly you do not say it like that you say supposedly and supposedly uh, the obli is right there we at the end uh, the pronunciation would be like that and uh, when we say supposedly, it's something that we used to believe or we believe as an individual, supposedly. It's what we think. For example, supposedly she went there at her place and then she came back. But we know we believe that and that actually happened. For example, we believe in Allah. And supposedly, we could say supposedly Allah did not uh, listen to her prayers. We could say that. That goes with supposedly. However, when it comes to supposedly, supposedly is when you uh, think something, it's like probably that might happen in the future but has not happened yet. That's when you use supposedly. Okay, uh, if this helped, please write down again. I'm telling you because it may sound annoying to you that I'm continuously telling you to write it down. But honestly, trust me, this is gonna help you and if you know that you have these notes, you could just, you know, when you say something and you can go back, check your notes and fix it quickly. So let's move on to number seven. So if you like it, do not forget to like, subscribe, click on the bell notification. Uh, do not forget to comment. And if you think I 
said anything wrong, pronounced them wrong, or you know, I gave you different type of um, idea about it or knowledge about it, do let me know and uh, help me out in this, right? We are all learning, we are all students, so have a nice day, stay safe, goodbye everyone!